How's it going guys? It's Pochi Settle. Welcome back to another episode of the Big Blue Blob campaign in Europa Universalis 4. Of course we are playing as France, going to uh, be fishing for that achievement. We have not a lot of time and I'm assuming that this is this or the next video will probably be the last for better or for worse. So again, we have to have this war, both of these wars done with all of these provinces taken by the end of 96 I believe yeah December of 96 and I don't know how this is gonna work but we're gonna try it so anyways let's go ahead and unpause we are on speed 4 that seems a little ridiculous uh, we have this battle going on against uh, the Bretons not too shabby the game is still working out some stuff I think but either way let's go ahead and uh, come over here Smash them up a little bit. The Protestant Reformation just fired in Württemberg. Well then, that's interesting. Good thing we won't have to deal with that nonsense. Probably. <laughs> no, we shouldn't have to, so that's good at least. Anyways. Okay, yeah, they're, they're still trying to transport troops over, which I'm a little confused by. They're basically just sending them all to their deaths, all those men. But, you know, I'll take it. I'll take free kills, you know. I'm, I think I'm okay with that. Uh, let's see. What else could we do here? No, I don't really care for that. Luckily, the Swedish are still disloyal, of course. And they just don't give a crap about their overlords. So that's really good for me. Uh, we do have to take this fort out, which sucks. Unless I can get my transports there, but we'll see. Um, man, I always forget that I own so much land. Jeez, it's ridiculous. Let's see. What about... We won the Siege of Anjou. Hey, that's pretty good. Actually, well, Provence did. Oh, and you know what? That's a core of theirs. Crap. I didn't realize that they were the ones... I forgot they were the ones actually in that war. Well, that's not good. Hopefully, they siege it back or they don't take it. I don't know if they're going to win, though. Provence. They are winning. That's the one that yeah, Burgundy declared dumb in a dumb way. Yeah, I remember that. Okay, whatever. We're gonna miss out on maybe one province. Shouldn't matter too much. Either way, let's not worry about it too much. For now, we'll just keep watching this stuff. Now we need to be min maxi, so let's make sure we're doing everything in the most efficient way possible. These guys are going to be here on the 20th of May. When are we going to make it? The 24th of June. Not going to be good enough. But still, we should go smash them up before they get to join together. Let's see. Where are you going? Mm, you're going to go there. So we'll go and smash you up real quick. Might as well. Free kills. Always a good thing. Ah, uh, I wish Poland and Lithuania would get their crap together. Come on, man. All you gotta do, literally all you gotta do is wait till your whole army is together and then coordinate with, with each other. You don't need to freaking go off and do it all by yourself. Come on, now. They're like, but that's the only way to do it. What are you talking about? Can we go here now? Should be able to, right? Yeah, we can. Alright, uh, no, we need you to be up there. So instead, we'll just do this. 9th of June. We should be able to catch them, right? Yeah. So let's go ahead and send you there. I want you to go all the way to there. And let's take, like, you guys. I'm gonna take you guys and go and back up, because we might need the backup, honestly. And, but once we do that, should be good. Uh, we should check up here again. We're about to smash that army up a little bit. You know, we might as well put our leader in charge. Even if he dies and we get a regency, it doesn't matter. We're already at war with our last two wars, like almost certainly. So, I'm not too worried about that. He's going to probably get the stack white. Yep, there we go. 
Oh, and look at that. Wow, they actually pieced out, but didn't take the land back. That's ridiculous. I can't believe it. We had, That's such a, you know, a stroke of good luck for us. And also, I'm a little confused, but why some of these things didn't finish or whatever, but you know what? That's okay. You're going to be there on the 28th of September. It should be fine. Let's go ahead and come back up here. Yeah, we defeated them in Bergenschusch. I mean, this is going just fine right now. The Brittany War should be over fairly soon, honestly. It's not going to be very hard. I'm so glad that they just found it somewhere in their heart to not actually... Uh, Take out that land. Okay, this is not good. I was hoping... I can't even make it there? Are you kidding me? Here, how about you come over here? That should buy us the time we need. Uh, I don't think we really care, but we will, I guess, take the... Claim... <laughs> Sure, why not? Alright, now we just gotta kinda figure out how in the fudge are we going to juggle these troops around in a way that'll let us, uh, that'll let us siege everything in time. Or, you know, well, quickly enough. Um, first off, first off, do we, can we, do, can we call you into any of these wars? No. I did not think so, but yeah. Poland, Lithuania, or if they're messing around, screwing around, doing whatever they're doing. Well, we're gonna have to siege this stuff somehow, so why don't we do this? First off, let's bring our navy down here. And that'll be the first step, I think. Beat up the Danish navy a little bit. Actually, come down to Normandy first. We don't want to necessarily attack them. Let's go ahead and uh, we should be able to catch them. Yeah. I think they're going to not be able to avoid us. Nope, they did somehow. I guess you will come back down here. That siege is going fairly well, which is good. We have to kind of time this right so that both sieges like you know if the sieges still last a whole year for this one and then for that one it should be okay and hopefully poland lithuania can do their part it looks like they're doing all right norway yeah they they have high enthusiasm they should be okay up there for now i hope so at least i really hope so let's go ahead and heal up right at the at the end of the month there we go Come down to Saint-Ton, Saint-Ton, I don't, Saint-Ton, I don't know, I don't know how to say that, whatever. Flanders just declared independence on Burgundy, now that is interesting, now that is interesting, it doesn't really affect us, but that's still interesting, like yeah, like honestly it doesn't matter, we're not going to be declaring that, we're just, you know, but still, it's, it's, it's still kind of funny to see that. Alright, let's take a... Uh... We need to get this going right away. So let's take this stack here, and we're going to transport you by sea, because apparently that's the only way you can get out of here, even though you walked in perfectly fine, because that makes sense, you know. Hmm. I wonder where they're retreating to. Well, no matter. All right, now you come down to here. And once this guy sieges that as well, we'll have some more. So we want to siege our capital first, obviously. That's the most important one. Are you kidding me? You can't even... Oh my god. Alright. There you go. There you go. You happy? Armor. Yeah, come down there. We need to siege that one first, so... That'll work. Alright. Let's make sure that we don't get attacked up here. We do not have a lot of manpower. That's something we should keep in mind. 
But uh, hopefully this siege falls ASAP, like now. Jeez, oh, come on, man. We really need it to fall soon. Hmm. And I want to... Let's see. Well, hey, you know what? You know what I, I didn't think about? We can actually look right now to see some of this stuff. So let's go, like, overextension. And we want to do the lowest overextension values. Of course, again, I do think that we're going to have to go over 100% overextension. Um, but yeah, 284. That's all. Wow. This one is going to be much more expensive, I'm sure. But I think, again, I think we're just going to full annex you. We have to. Oh my god, but the, the coalition, though. Can we handle a coalition of that size? I didn't even think about that. Who are we allied to again? Let's let's look at this. So we are allied to Poland, Castile, Savoy, which they asked for a royal marriage and I did not accept. I will give you a royal marriage. And the other one was we are guaranteeing Muscovy or Novgorod. Okay, Novgorod. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm going to revoke that guarantee in a second. Hey, look at that. Poland's going to win another battle against Sweden, which is funny because they don't really need to. But whatever. Now, if there's one more person that we can maybe get allied to. No, that's not what I want to do. Um, Hungary. Ah, uh, yes. All right, well. Okay, well, we might have to... Uh, I don't know. We're Like, we're going to have to have a coalition... Or, you know, a possibility for a coalition, at least. If we want to have a small chance, even a small chance at this. So, let's keep that in mind. But, yeah. We just need a little bit more than 3,000. No, we're going to need that. So, let's take you. Move you out to there. Alright. Um, I don't know, man. Do we, can we get away with a coalition, you know? Or, you know, avoid a coalition? We'll see, I guess. It's the 2nd of February. We only have, like, 18 months, man. That's crazy. How are we going to do this? We just have to try hard. I don't know, man. Let's see, we have our, our navies here. Let's see if we can't bring them up here. I wonder if they'll, I don't know if they'll actually engage us or not. They have a they have a big navy, I'm not gonna deny that. Also, they have, what are they, they have Hamburg and Utrecht on their side. Okay, that's fine. No, see, this is not good. We need to be able to get this guy over there. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, come on, man. We really need this. Oh, okay. So, no. The garrison on this would be really dumb. Especially seeing that we don't have any manpower in the bank. So we shouldn't do that. Yeah, we can't do that again. I don't know. I really hope that falls soon. Let's see, the Breton fleet is actually included here. Okay, and we should actually. Looks like they're transporting this dude. We should be able to cut them off. Should be good. That'll be fun. Water shortage. Or, no, walls breached. That's even better, actually, probably. It's good. We might have to hire some mercs. And, in fact, I probably should just do that. Let's go ahead and... Let's do that. Let's, uh... Consolidate there and hire two longbows. And we might actually even assault there. There we go. Ah, uh, that didn't even do anything, really. Um... Of course, we lose another tick of siege. Oh, we really need these guys to... To do better. Faster. Okay. 
probably going to want to retreat here in a second. Yeah, we're taking some damage. So we lost a galley. That's okay. We killed two transports, but we'll see. We'll see. Oh, come on. We really need this to be lucky. It's not being lucky, though. Okay, what I think we might do is we might just use our infantry and assault this. Our uh, Merc infantry. Maybe, like, what we might do is we might actually just take out our... Well, I don't know if that's a really smart idea, because otherwise we might not win. Let's try it, man. Mm, again, most of that is Merc. Not all of it, though. Only a year and a half. Okay, it's looking a little bit less likely now, maybe, that we'll be able to do this, but... We'll see. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me! How many times can you roll a 1? It's not a 1, I guess. It's like 2 to 7, so... It's a little bit more reasonable when you say it like that, but still. Come on, man. Hmm... Do you think we can do this? I don't know. Again, we're gonna have to... I think... Well... I think we just kinda dump some money into Merc, so why not? And... Again, part of that can be that maybe... Let's take all you guys and consolidate. So that way we can actually have the room for those mercs. There you go. And that'll be nice. Hamburg wants to come fight us. Oh, interesting. Didn't realize you were so ballsy. Okay, well... Good luck with that, mate. Uh, it's only grasslands, though. Oh my. I still don't know exactly, you know, how we're gonna handle all this, but... We'll see. Lithuania, did you really attack across a crossing? Really? Really? Is that really a smart idea? Come on now, man. Yep, Protestantism and Trench, sure. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, group up these dudes. And I think what we're going to have to do is once this siege finishes, if it finishes at this point, we're going to have to bring in our troops and just we're going to have to go straight to their capital, I think. And I don't, even then, we might not be able to get it. So... Got maximum monarch points and stuff. Uh, oh yeah, I was actually gonna look at it was like three hundred for that other one. This would be like three, like four hundred. That's like six hundred points. So we might actually want to take this first idea, although it doesn't. You wouldn't think that this is actually gonna help at all, but I think it might. We'll see. War exhaustion, I'm not going to worry about right now. I got bigger fish to fry. Hey, right. going to beat up their navies. There we go. We won the Siege of Smallland, finally. Oh, finally. Alright, looks like there's no way to get out of this battle, so let's just go and fight it.
That really sucks. Oh my. I only have like one year left to do this whole achievement, so. I think I'm gonna drop it down once. Oh, and they reinforced, wow. And Poland is nowhere to be seen. Oh, there's Lithuania though. Hey, there we go. All right, we won the Siege of Nantes. That's really important. A lot of men are dying right here. <laughs> I wonder, are they... They're still rebellious. I don't know why they're helping. I guess just because it's their land that was sieged down, so... I suppose that's reasonable enough. Yo, why are you going all the way up to Trondelag? I don't have time for that. That sucks. So what if we took all that land? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. That's a lot of freaking points. I don't think we can take all that. Really, I don't know, man. It's not looking too great for our chances. We have now, as of right now, we have a year left to finish a war against Denmark, and they are looking fairly entrenched. So I'm not sure if this is gonna be possible. Guess we'll find out. Twenty sixth of January. No, I don't want you to retreat back to that. Oh my god, whatever. Uh, okay, let's see. Hmm. I'm not going to take an offer until you're willing to accept this. I don't know, man. Burgundian inheritance is not looking too likely. <sighs> oh, hey, they siege back their stuff, which actually might be good for me. Okay, the Lithuanians are there. Probably going to go attack them or something dumb like that. Uh, so we could go there, to here. Oh, that makes sense. You guys can just walk through the, the, uh, zone of control. No problem. Okay. We're going to bring our army over here. And basically, my thinking is... Literally, our only chance is if we take, like, you know, our, uh, well, let's, first of all, first of all, let's shift consolidate, and we're going to take the ones that have the highest, uh, you know, the highest number. That's nine. We have ten. Okay, so we can take another, we can take ten. All right, so let's take, uh, ten. I guess we'll do Mercs, uh, Mercs first, probably, because this is a high risk thing. We're gonna do three, that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna put the general in charge, attach you to the boats, and we're gonna go and see if we can't make it to their capital. Of course, because on. No, I don't. Care. That was because I was trying to get out of Regency. No. Um, it doesn't make any sense. Yo, do you really think your fleet can handle mine? Move your fleet, bro. Alright, we're going to have to fight him. It's already April, man. It's bad. Okay, there we go. There we go. Come on, Denmark, move your fleet. 
I don't want to have to fight you. This is not good. Okay, so this, luckily this war we can take like twice as long on. So that's good. Okay, attach you. I'm going to wait till like the 29th or something. Yeah, there you go. Now you get that recovery tick. And now you're at sea. Come on. Come on. We really need to be able to win this battle. This naval battle, please. Mm, they got reinforced. Not good. Now they attacked us up there. Mm, this is not good. Not good at all. Uh, I think we need to retreat. Oh, ho, 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 ho. it's painful. I don't think we're going to be able to do this, guys. I don't think so. Uh, even the only way I think we could possibly do it is if we got a Burgundian inheritance to fire. Because let, let's see, like, one, two, three, four, five. Four actually, only four. One, two, three, four. Uh, so seven, eight, uh, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Uh, of course, they're in a war of independence, so I don't know if that, how that would work. Plus, they have a king. It's not very likely. <laughs> well, that stinks. And they already seized it back. What the fudge? That's ridiculous. I don't know, man. This is weird. Hmm. They have so many navies just combined. Everything combined. They got quite a formidable navy. I will give them that. But hey, at least uh, Lithuania is going to town over there. Man, why? England got declared an independence war? What the fudge? That's weird. Okay, then. Looks like these guys, it looks like they're probably about to come down here to attack them. Oh, because they're cut off. They can't reinforce. Huh. Well, good luck then, Lithuania. You're on your own. Okay. So... We could take this many, and we would have a huge coalition, like, guaranteed. This one would be much less. I mean, honestly, though, it's not going to matter. Let's do it. Come on. Let's see if it works, uh, or, you know, if, if we can work this out. Alright, so you guys... Let's group you up. Let's go ahead and we immediately want to start making a new core. We want to, um... Oh god, that was all of our points. What the fudge? It said it wasn't going to be all of our points and then it lied. Oh, you know what it was? I think it's because uh, Anjou is included in there. So, why don't we stop Anjou just because, you know. Maybe if we hold off on that one, we'll have enough for other stuff. If we have enough for other stuff, you know. Uh, what was I gonna do next? I start by unrest. All right. Either way, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here, though. So thank you guys for watching. Go leave a like and bleh, like and subscribe for more. This has gone way over, actually, but that's okay. Thank you, uh, and I'll see you guys in the next video when we come back and hopefully finish this off for better or for worse. So I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.